Hello there good people, I hope you are doing well. Greetings from Portugal, I hope you are doing well. So today, uh, the 8th of uh, October, Apple just released, uh, well, just released a few hours ago, the third beta of macOS Mojave, so 10.14.1, okay? The third beta of this build. Now, for, I'll talk a little bit about the first, the raw data, Geekbench, Compute, Metal and everything, then I'll go through some bugs that I encountered and if they are fixed or not and also um, some new things that uh, are on this build. Now, regarding the download, it took about, well, it is a, the amount is about 2.4 gigabytes, uh, almost the same amount as the previous build, okay? Now, the build number for this release, it is the 18B57C, the specs of the model, pause it, and you can see and compare to yours. Now, uh, regarding the Geekbench, I'm seeing here a trend, not a positive trend, but either way, this is the Geekbench for the beta 2, okay? For the 10.14.1, as you can see here, and this is the Geekbench for this beta. Now, uh, I'm seeing a trend since the first beta of this uh, .1 release. Uh, we are decreasing on multi-score, okay? Um, and now we have a slight increase on the single core on this new one. But okay, nothing. Geekbench is Geekbench, you know. Uh, as I always say, I prefer to see, you know, the real usage on the daily tasks. Now, regarding the metal performance on the compute, the on the beta... Two, this was the result, and on the beta three regarding the compute, let me check over here. It is there is a slight increase, nothing major, but well, it is an increase. Okay, guys. So this is raw data aside. Okay, for the guys that like to see it, and I know I know some some don't. So let's go ahead first on what can we expect over here. What I have noticed first is, uh, and I have to recheck, of course I will make a video on this. I had, let me go, not here, security and privacy. I had here, okay, on the allow apps downloaded from uh, a third option that is the anywhere option. And for either reason, I don't know why, it's not available anymore, okay? I will have to, you know, to put again the terminal command in order to enable for me to install apps from, you know, third party or non-approved, you know, developers or ident identified developers. If you have that issue, go ahead and put on the comments below, okay? And of, of course, if you want to know how you can enable that option, put, a, put that and I'll make a video on that issue, okay? So this is the first thing that I noticed. Regarding new things, guys, here, nothing, okay, nothing new. Um, wallpapers, nothing new also, okay. Same of wallpapers, I'm expecting new dynamic wallpapers. You know, uh, let's see if Apple do, does that or not. So there isn't anything here to, to expect, okay. I would like to see, you know, an option, there is a workaround, okay. But an option just to have dark mode, not the dark mode, just to have the menu and the dock on the dark, you know, modes and still cap, uh, keep the, you know, the, the light windows, okay. But, well, that's not an option um, anymore here. So here, I don't saw uh, anything new, okay. Now, there is uh, one thing I will blur, of course, all, all of this. But uh, there is the new Unicode 11, okay, okay, so there are lots and lots and 70, you know, I, I'm not the kind of guy that, you know, uses emojis, but if you are that kind of, of guy or girl or whatever, of person, um, you have 70 new emojis in order for you to use um, uh, the same thing as iOS, okay, the same emojis as iOS. Now. Regarding one of the things that I found and I am still found, finding is some issues on the rendering in Safari, uh, you know, uh, you know, see that jump over there, still here, still present, it takes a little bit and then 
everything goes to normal so it is still present on this build on the others you know if i click on other sites for example everything it's very fluid but on youtube with that all that pictures and everything uh, something doesn't work well since the first release for this 10.14.1 so i don't know uh, what what is going on so guys besides that uh, everything here it is normal keep in mind okay final cut uh, seems to be a little bit uh, after the first video that i made i didn't make a follow-up on the second beta but now it seems to be a little bit you know more fluid when i'm exporting when i'm exporting the videos okay guys so uh even though i expect i'm expecting that apple doesn't forget final cut and you know give us you know an update for you know um for this release of Mac OS Mojave, okay, an updated version of Final Cut Pro uh, 10. I'm anxious, I'm very anxious to see a new update uh, for this. So guys, for now, this is all. Of course, these are the first few hours of using it. Uh, if uh, you find anything new, go ahead, put on the threads, on the comment below, what you are finding on this, on these new betas. Uh, for the dot one okay and uh, if you have any questions go ahead and i'll try to answer most of them okay so thank you so much for watching stay safe and i will see you on the next one bye bye